Mmm. You can see that that igneous rock that I grabbed to build that is hot. That was, that's not good. It's only 100 degrees though. I can deal with that. That's fine. And then this should... Are you, Biffy, are you stuck? No, you're not. Okay, you're just idle. Just chilling in here, I guess. So this should... Oh, it's a vacuum underneath it. Uh-oh. It's respirating, though. It's aspirating, I should say. I think that's fine. So this room, it's gonna get... Yeah, it's gonna get full for sure. The bottom is actually much less than the top. Barely breathable. Up top is, like, rich. Yeah, wow, funny. There seems to be... You know what? I bet there's a there's an issue here. Um has a vacuum to grab air. Well, I, I do see that there's like, there's no transfer of gases between the top and the bottom. I wonder if there, if it's because the Weez Wart is actually creating a block. Um, so, like there's like the top one is full, but the bottom one is not. So I wonder if I should, I think it's breathe, it's aspirating and then throwing it up and not aspirating and going in all directions, right? Exactly, yeah, see Victor, yeah, see, same page, same page. So let's go ahead and do this. We'll, uh, we'll deconstruct this. And then we'll move it down, replace it here. And then just a regular farm tile. And that'll solve the problem. Now you can already see the gases are starting to distribute themselves a little more evenly. Look at that, what a difference. So that way we can still cool this room. The one Weez Wart's still gonna do work. It's still gonna- Oh shit, they can't get down there. <laughs> that... maybe? Uh, can they build one? No, it'll, it'll remove the plant. I think from here? They can't. No, they can't. Uh, damn. can't build one on top of the ladder. <laughs> oh, man. I'm trying to think where I want to put that. Should I put it one step down? No, 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 because I want it to be in the midst of things. Let's let them... Ah. Uh. Oh man, I don't want to sacrifice any more of these bliss, bristle bristle blossoms, but I'm gonna have to. Um, remove a yeah yeah yeah. That's what I'm saying. I have to uh, um, like basically remove one of them on one side and put it in. I could put the door on this side, but no, they they won't be able to access the top. They just put a fucking door here. <laughs> Stop being an asshole. I wanted to seal it off, but clearly that's just not gonna be an option right now without redoing a whole bunch of stuff. And I don't want to do that. So. Okay, well, let's go ahead and, uh, X. We'll wait for it to be done doing whatever it's doing. Thank you. Wait, is there anything else under here? No, okay, good. At least that way I don't have to worry about... There you go. There. There! And that could just- they'll, that this will work. This will totally work. Okay. So I wonder how quickly this room can uh, cool off. This is, this is a hot door here. 100 degrees. Everything else is 100 degrees. Jeez. Did you have two tile wide outside for room- the room for gases? You mean outside the room? Yeah, there's two tiles right here. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Now, will it go too cold? 84.8. It's working. And it'll just sit there. It'll just continue to do its thing and take care of all that. How's this going? Huh, this, I wonder why it hasn't planted the... Uh, it keeps taking them out, but it's not planted. Oh, it's eating it. Okay. Oh, Navy Devil keeps cleaning the shit up. I 
should be low a priority for him. Well, I think it was his luck that he went and found that. Ooh, we're filling up with hydrogen. That's exciting. Because once this area gets full of hydrogen, then we could start uh, working on a um, a cooling system for this room. Check sweep only on the storage bin. Let me see. Ah, oh, okay, cool. So they won't come over and just... Oh, okay. I, like, basically never do that. I, I see the usefulness of it, though. I, I think I think you're right. We should probably put a small deodorizer uh, over here. Just because there... I mean, there's there is enough here and it's going to move its way down. Let's just go ahead. Instead of ejecting the space, let's we'll make it clean. It's a good amount. Like, across, across the board here, it's a pretty fair amount, yeah. So that'll take care of it. Just a regular deodorant. No, nothing crazy. It said deliver snazzy suit. Oh, yeah. Snazzy going on storage. Defeat that stank is exactly what we're doing. There it goes. Chicka, 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 chicka. Probably going to clear through that pretty quickly as well. I should put it like right down here or something. That way it gets on the pass through, but now it'll take too long. That's why I get, get rid of it. Let's see. Starting to click that salt water. Got tons of it over here. Yeah, getting this getting this tile tamed. And this is gonna be a problem. Like, we have a lot of resources that are just hot. Like just hot. Um and, you know, the idea, what I was thinking of initially was to put them all down here and then just have, um, just allow uh, gases to pass through, get heated up, and then suck it and throw it out into space, like carbon dioxide specifically. Uh, but we might have to continue going until we could fill this room with hydrogen as well. Basically, if this entire bottom area is hydrogen, it'll be so much easier to, to manage in terms of, uh, keeping this area cool. We could expand it out. We could add a whole bunch more natural gas generators or whatever else we want. Move everything around and uh, and just have the ultimate freedom down here so long as we just continue to um, use thermal regulators on. Is that a... Oh, it's ice. What is that doing just chilling there? Storage unavailable. That's bullshit. Oh my god, my bin is full. Huh. This thing's probably freezing. Oh, it's not. How funny. Even though it's full of ice. 20 tons of ice at negative 10 degrees. And it's still not enough. What the fuck am I going to use ice for? 20 tons of ice, guys. Help me out here. What can I, I can't build ice blocks. Uh, I could put it in... Fuck, I don't know. 20 tons. That's a huge mass. Shift plates in the cool room. Around, wait, around. Oh, out of ice. Oh, well, that shit melts like immediately. Um, isn't there an ice air cooler? Yeah, but it's dupe operated. Let's go and build another one of these, though. He made some cooling tiles around the cooling machine there. The ice, ice came from uh, either sweeping or uh, from the delivery from the uh, uh, the replicator, the spawner, or whatever it's called. So you're saying replace all these tiles back here that are made out of obsidian with uh, with ice around the thing here? But this thing is putting out... Oh, God, it's, it's just going to melt. It's just going to melt. It's not going to work. This is getting pretty warm, right? Ah, oh, 90 degrees is fine. The spice! 32 months! That's a good number. Why is this a good number? This is age thing. Uh, not replace, but you could add them. Alright, let's do this. Let's do- I I'm curious. I'm genuinely curious. I want- I want to see this work. So let's do it. Let's fucking do it. Yeah, I want to see this work. Temp shift plate. Let's make it out of ice. Fuck it. I'm not doing anything else with ice. I have so much. Let's just do like, um, be like right across here. Let's finish this off. There we go. 
And we'll see what that does. Still hydrogen gas down there, right? Yes, absolutely. Good. This is nice having so many suits. Look at these guys. Wow, look how quickly they're... Like the whole area. Wow. Hmm. Uh-oh. Getting warm. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Getting warm. I wonder what their melting point is on these. Let's see. Uh... Oh, there they go. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Oh, God. The whole area is flooded. All right. Let's... Background building. What if I could tear it apart before... Before they're all done. You know that melt is taking heat out. You think it's enough, though? Do you think it's enough? You think if I make a whole bunch of... Pipes, or, uh, uh, uh temp shift plates... And they all melt, that that's actually going to be a good thing. Long term. I mean, I'm not doing anything else with the ice, guys, so maybe you should just go and try it. Yeah, the, exactly, exactly. What else am I going to use it for? Yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. This, 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 this is a fair point. I think if I'm going to do it, I should probably do it maybe further away out here, like in this area where it's like really dense with a whole bunch of, uh, of, um, things. Let me see, that's good. When you have to get the boy, I uh, I gotta I like that you guys call him the boy too. It's a weird. That's a Jen and I call him the boy. Um, uh, we're gonna pick him up and probably leave here and like or get out of here in like thirty, like thirty minutes. So just like a little earlier than normal. It would bring down the temps up. You're right because there's def there is heat exchange there. So yeah, let's fucking do it. Let's just throw a whole bunch up right through here. They're all passing through this area anyways. Um... Uh oh don't move, don't move. Everybody freeze. Okay. And that's it. Oh. Nope, it's not it. It's gonna be a fucking flood. Oh my god, how many of these- Oh shit, no, it switched- it switched resources. Uh, damn it, I hate when it does that. I kinda really hate when it does that. Automatically switches resources. Oh my god. All, all, all. There. Fuck. Let's try it again. Utilities, temperature plates. Let's see. Uh, ice. Ice. Okay, we'll keep an eye on how much we're actually using here. Mm. Okay, I think it switched right there. Cemetery rock. This one is granite. No, no. Uh, ice. Okay, cool. That's the end of the ice right there. It'll very slowly go away, but what's nice is this is like really cold water that's getting fed into what? Oh, into this. <laughs> into this shithole! <laughs> uh, irrigation. Let's go ahead and empty this out. Let's see. Uh, empty storage on that. <laughs> I was like, oh cool, that's some cool water. We could probably go ahead and, uh, you know, use that somewhere else. It's like, oh yeah, just dump it in here with all this other 90 degree water. Although, we'll cool this water though. It'll technically cool this water. So yeah, the question is, once it's done, is it going to have a significant impact on the heat level. Actually, you know, we're, 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 um, we might run into a problem with the machines not working because of the lack of, uh, water flow of irrigation. But yeah, look at that. The templates are just dis disappearing immediately. What is that? One back? Oh, it's gone. Okay. It's so, it's, it's so satisfying, like seeing the, even though they disappear so quickly, it's so satisfying to see them, uh, uh, you know, go from ice to just, and you get that little shift in temperature. And then, I wish there was a way to see, like, get an hour, like a room average temperature, you know? Like, I wonder if there's a mod for that. If I, if I hover my mouse over a room and, like, maybe hold on, like, a troll ship or something like that, 
um, if it'll tell me, like, all the gases in the area, in the room, are blank temperature. Uh, I know that it will... I know that it will, uh, show me... Don't tolerance. Uh, I, I know that when you're in sandbox mode, you could, there's a, there's like a paint, br or a, a paint bucket option, so it's like a fill, right? So it'll fill everything of that type with whatever it is that you select. These are actually lasting for quite a while. Um, they must not be made of the right stuff. <laughs> That's the only thing I could think of. It must be made of the wrong thing. Uh, no, it's ice. It's ice. Oh, hey. But anyways, yeah, I wish you could get like a room, a room level, uh, you know, stats in terms of like, this room is blank. Those are sticking it up, man. You know what? It, it's working because this area was yellow. So it's definitely, you know, doing something. I wonder how long it's going to last. And then this is all nice, cool water down here. There it goes. So this is all pretty cool water down here. What is this? Uh, water, 32 degrees. Perfect. Just barely enough here. And actually, I probably should make sure they don't go through this door for now. That way, uh... It'll give it time for all that stuff to irrigate because it takes a while for all that stuff to come out. So the question is then, how cold is the water going in? It is going in at about uh, 90 degrees on average. It's coming out at a couple like bursts of like 90 something, but I would say probably 80 degrees on average on this one here. So, oh, it's really hot water coming in now. Well, we'll see what happens. Heat transfer overlay. Uh, the state change? Thermal ther 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 tolerance? State change? What are we looking at here? Oh, you mean for like a separate thing? State change? Yeah, I don't, I don't know how to read that, dude. State change. What does that mean exactly? I understand like this is cooler water, but like what is the... Like, what does that mean? in this context. The cooler it is, it's bluer, but that just seems, yeah. This thing is at 100. Okay, so the natural gas generator has gone up by 1.5 degrees, so it is getting warmer. Blue means cooling. Oh, green means steady. Red is getting heat. Oh shit, did it say right there? Stay change. Ah, okay, so cool. Low energy state change. Okay, so... Uh, nearing a low energy state change. Oh, so if it's blue, that means it's... Well, green's stable. Hmm. <laughs> yes, Chiro, that's exactly what you gotta do. <laughs> oh, look at this mix. This is a mess. It's all kinds of nasty, nasty everything down here. Arbor Acorn, sure. How's this room doing? Let's see. Well, it did bring down the temperature a bit, but not much, man. Considering that it's just sitting here, like just, it's just, at, just constantly aspirating, just constantly. I'm surprised that it's not. It's still not doing enough. Hmm. Takes time. I know, but I had a 10x speed. We went through like three or four cycles already. I guess it's not fair to compare to this because this is like a behemoth of cool air. Like, look at this. <laughs> this whole area is cold because of that. Where's my arbor tree? I have a feeling that he doesn't have enough room to drop the arbor tree. You know what I'm saying? Like, maybe I should uproot this. And that might help more space or something. Uh, let's say vent heat out the top. Uh, oh, the top of the thing here. Um, yeah, I know it takes time, but yeah, I, I just figured like the Wii's would do more in in a short period. You could see it moving. It's actually it is it is actually doing something. But man, climate change in actually had yeah yeah. No, I mean, it's funny, like, with the carbon dioxide build up and you see how quickly it generates heat and just basically insulates everything. Like, that, that's your first, that's your, that's a good first-hand look at what exactly, um, what you get with the, the climate change. Carbon dioxide and all that build up. 
I'm basically just waiting for this room to fill up. Really, is all I'm doing. And once this area is full up, why is this thing not pipe block? Uh oh. Nope. No, no, no. Oh. Oh! They're not breathing enough. <laughs> they need to breathe more. Well, it's fine. Do I have some, uh, maybe I could steal some hydrogen from somewhere and chop it off. Uh oh, that top one is pulling oxygen. Oh, no, 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 no. Stop, stop, stop. That's not good. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. It's not good because, uh, this system is not- doesn't have a filter on it. So it's gonna be dumping just hydrogen, oxygen, uh, we want hydrogen only. Not oxygen and all that other stuff. Frostpunk? Nah, I probably won't play it again, honestly. I'm not- I don't- I don't feel like, you know, being depressed. <laughs> I got my fill of the game, I like it, it's great, I- but no, it's not something I'd I, I don't think I'll go back and check it out. Boy, it really takes a long time to empty that out. Oh man, this one's just gonna get shit on because of this. It's fine, whatever. I don't know what else to do next. Like, I mean, look at my list here. Repla reclaim metals, replace inner insulated tiling. Um, yeah, maybe we should start doing that, actually. Reclaim some materials here by just getting rid of some of the, uh... Yeah, what is this? this is uh, we don't necessarily need igneous rock, uh, or was well, aluminum? Like, for example, all this mesh is aluminum ore, so we should definitely get rid of some of that. Um, and then I guess leave like a two gap wide air tile on a bunch of them. Yeah, love the game, but it hurts my soul. Exactly, exactly. So let's see. Yeah, so we'll basically mirror what we have up here, but we'll just use regular tiles to. to we don't necessarily need the insulation, uh, but I do want this mesh back. So let me see. Da, da, da. Move to the left. We'll do. We'll uh, like alternate it is what we'll do. And then was that one, two, three across the middle? It looks like it. And that's fine. This one's fine. This one will do the same thing. Oh, that's already got cut out in the middle, so we'll do this one here. And then... God. Time it. Every time I pause, I'm afraid it's gonna send crazy build orders everywhere. This is gonna be a bit troublesome because I do want to have... I guess I'll, you know, I'll put it on the bottom, actually. So I'll do, like, kind of both. So I'll do to the middle. But at least this way I could get back some of my... Some of my resources. <laughs> Damn it. Gold, decor plus. We need a couple of them, so. Copper instead. I don't have a lot of copper. I'm getting back a ton from these, right? Let me see, what are these made out of? Aluminum ore, okay. Hmm. More resistant to soul damage. <laughs> um, yeah, gold. I think we just have more gold that we can mine, so I don't mind using. I wish I could find a gold volcano or whatever. That would be superb. Okay, good. Now replace all of this. Should we replace this insulated tile on the sides? This one doesn't have any vents on the bottom. Let's put a couple here, and here. That should be good. What up, Nitsut? What's happening? So good, that'll, that'll take them a long time to actually get through. Uh, but yeah, those that mesh just does not need to be, like, I mean, it's material that we really need elsewhere in the base. So I was gonna get rid of that. So they'll chew on that for a long time. Aluminum ore here, yeah, see all this stuff. Aluminum ore, aluminum, aluminum, this we need, but... Would you like to deal with hot gold right now? <laughs> yes! <laughs> Especially if it's nowhere near the base. 
because this entire area down here is all thankfully just going to be managed by um by suited dupes like everything down here is suited dupes over here is, as a matter of fact i could probably go ahead and uh yeah we could do this we can oh shit now they can't get in here without triggering that um oh you know what we'll open this up no we won't just kidding nah. <laughs> we're not gonna do that uh, I was going to say we could go up here and we could study this thing and see when this thing's going to go, uh, going to blow again. But welcome home. <laughs> Open the door. You hit the hit. Hold it. Oh, it was putting my my first came up. Oh, <laughs> stop! Like, stop sorry, abusing the dog. <laughs> Love you, babe. Gentle. Liquid hot magma. Mm-hmm. Uh, are there any uh, any close covered geysers? There are a few geysers around. Um, I mean, there's, a whole, there's all kinds of areas we've not yet explored, but now that they're suited, I kind of want to start taking them on little adventures to go exploring and digging. Like, there's all kinds of stuff over here we haven't yet explored yet. Um... Hi, Donut. Yes, I know. She's home. Mom's home. Come up here and say hi. Up. Oh, oh, God. Oh, good. Oh, hi. Oh, my gosh. Oh, okay. Yeah. Here. You can say hello. You can say hello to everybody. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Yes. Oh, you so heavy. Oh, look at that. Look at this dog. <laughs> good boy. Good boy. Mwah. Wanna go downstairs? You go. You go play. Go play. Good boy. <laughs> Time for the belly dry. I know. Give him a couple couple slaps. <laughs> All right. So what are we doing here? Um. Wow, this thing's putting out some heat. <laughs> so. Most everything is running fine. We're pretty much just waiting for this area to fill up with hydrogen. Uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, we've got the... Oh, wow. We're actually losing control of the carbon dioxide, actually. This whole bottom area is still hurting. Um, I wonder if I should put oxyferns in their room. Uh, do they still care about that? What is the decor value of a... Oxyferns minus 10. Hydroponic farms so is minus 15. This room sucks anyways. We could probably uh, spice it up by putting some other stuff in here to increase the, the decor. But yeah, I feel like these bottom these bottom rooms are going to need to have... Um, yeah, I think they just need it. Just don't get around it, pretty much. We have plenty, so let's do this. Let's cancel this one. And then let's put a farm here. Let's see. Hydroponic farm, you. Hydroponic farm, you. You. Okay, try again. And then we'll we'll put like art or something in the room to offset the uh, <laughs> how upset they're gonna be. And this one is actually already sitting on some water, which is cool. And this one just needs a couple more. Great. And then we'll copy the settings. Ooh. Not ideal, but they'll be fine. They just like literally cannot breathe down there, so you just gotta do something. Okay, let's speed this one up. So I'm okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Good. And then good. They'll work on that. Sandstone, sure. There's lots where they let you breathe, yeah, but they're yeah, they're ugly. Probably negative, probably losing. Yeah, look at that. It's so upset. Minus minus fifteen decor value in here. But I think we could offset that pretty easily with some temp shift plates or some uh, drywall. Actually, we could probably just yeah, let's do that. This is that way they're not. I don't want to. <laughs> poor guys. I don't want to just let them just roast down there with nasty, nasty uh, decor. See, decor plus 10%, decor plus 20% out of granite. There we go. We have tons of granite too, so.
Good. There we go. How much granite we have? We have, wow, this is so much. We could just do like everything, actually. Crown mold, maybe. We'll see what we'll see what we get with this. I don't want to turn this into another another this situation here, right? I don't know if I wanna <laughs> I don't wanna do all that. <laughs> but we'll probably end up getting there. Uh, I think what we should probably do is move the conveyor system up where it's a little bit more reachable. Because right now it's 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 doing fine down there, but 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 uh what is it, shift F3? Yeah, there it is. But I think that we need to make it more accessible. So I think we actually put it right here, actually, would probably be perfect. Yeah, so let's go ahead and build another uh, conveyor rail. Remember, we don't have a lot of metal to spare for this kind of work, so we have to be careful. But look, we just got all this aluminum ore right here, so that is great. We could use some of it. So we'll go up, and we'll just go through that. It's fine. And that is the bottom of the top. It connects to the bottom. Cool. So we could just go like this, and then they'll just come down here, and they'll load up the conveyor. Easy. Easy peasy. And then that's it. Actually, that's all I have to do. Because right now, like, there's a bunch of stuff. Look at all this crap that's all over the place. All this aluminum ore that's kind of laying around. And we're not really getting anything anywhere with it. Oh, what's going on here? Body temperature. Man. 86.1 degrees. So you know what? It is getting cooler in there. But damn, it's taking a long time. It's fine. It's fine. How dense is that carbon dioxide? We're at right here? Uh, pretty dense. Body temperature problem, huh? 104 degree, point one. Huh. In the room? Uh, pretty, pretty dense there as well. Hmm. I have a feeling this is not helping much. I know what I have to do. I know what I have to do. Uh, I was on the I was on the right path, but I do need to. I think basically everything down here needs to be gas tile because the one one wide tile is not enough to let that gas flow. But if I do this then it it will simulate basically you know more more space for the gas to move <clears throat> i think that'll help making the entire bottom porous essentially but yeah like this thing's already this thing's not happy this thing is uh also not happy 104.1 degrees let's drop a reese reese wharton there rip metal yeah but it's, uh, I think the gold amalgam we have... A lot, so... We've been using it, uh, pretty liberally, uh, across a lot of things, but we still have a ton, so I think that we're... We'll eventually get to, um... Oh, guys, so cute. Uh, we will event Is he hungry? Is he- is he hungry? Hold on, he's starving! Time until death, 0.2 cycles. <sighs> How do I feed him real fast, guys? So he's not eating, he's not, the arbor tree is not happening. Should I bring some wood over here? Um. Oh shit, one of, one of the uh, organic. Oh, it's not organic. Uh, what is under? Industrial ingredient? For... No, reed fiber. Sorry, I'm just thinking, I was like, ah, damn, I'm gonna lose this fucking guy. Metal ore. What the fuck? What the fuck is it under? I thought it was under industrial ingredient. Lumber. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did I just look at it and didn't see it? See, industrial ingredient. Oh, lumber. I did, I did look at it and not do anything. Okay. You should need some lumber on the ground, but there's no lumber on the ground. Uh, let's make that like a... Fuck. Somebody deny, deny something. Bring it, bring it, bring it, bring it, bring it, bring it, bring it quick. Oh god, he's gonna die. 94 seconds. Somebody bring some lumber. Too bad you can't just tell him to pick something up and move it here. Everything's been cleaned up already. Uh oh, here we go.
Goddamn somebody. Okay, like anybody now. Now I'm opening the I'm opening the gates. There! Eat it! Eat it! Eat it! Eat it! Eat it! Did it work? It's right down the floor! It's right down the floor! Whatever, we got some food. Might not eat it off the floor. Oh, so he's picky. Well, you know what then? He fucking deserves to die. <laughs> he's picky. Uh. Alright, well. Just like, just looking at food. Just died looking at food. Quality of the tongue like that. Jeez. Oh, he's power too for this. So, I wonder if this actually worked. Body, it's so hot down here. Man, these guys cannot... 106 degrees. God damn. Even with the insulation, double, triple insulated, like, yeah, look at all that heat coming from... It's the, it's the pipes, man. It's the water coming in the pipes. Um... It's gotta be, because... I mean, look, the liquid... Yeah, the water is 120 degrees inside of these pipes. And it's just it's just sitting there. It's just sitting there. So it's got to be it. It's it's the it's the pipes that are that are um, heating this whole area. Uh, yeah, it's the car the carbon's holding the heat, sure, but it's the pipes that are that's that's heating it up. Um, I don't really feel like I have a. What is the solution here? I mean, I could drain this water out, so I can't really drain it out. Actually, I have to let it go through its pipes. Yeah, it's a giant. Exactly, it's a giant radiator. Hmm. Should have saved those uh, ice, <laughs> ice uh, temperature plates. Allow manual use. Um. Can I copy these settings? Copy settings. There we go. <sighs> There's so much carbon dioxide. I mean, getting the carbon dioxide out would definitely help a lot. And I don't think these oxyphorins can't, they can't take the heat. I should probably just replace, I should probably just put in a, uh, um, damn machine a scrubber I wonder if I should put the scrubber down here in the corner and let all that because over here it's 2,000 over here it's uh, 1,000 so clearly it's all well I mean I think it's probably some of it's stuck but I've cut all this out I could put a, a scrubber right here and just let it flow in there replace all this with um, with gas tiles or something Try to think. Fuck. Uh. Obviously, yeah. So it's like the wa the the carbon dioxide being so condensed is, is definitely heating up the area because of the pipes. But if we clear out the if we clear out the um, carbon dioxide, I'm trying to think of how I want to do it though. Like if I go boom, boom, boom. Is there anything else underneath this? Let's do it. Let's put it here. Okay, cool. Uh, not background buildings, I damn it. Just fucking buildings. And we'll get rid of this one too. And we'll replace. Come on. Come on, click on it. And then. This should work. Yeah, it's nice flow. We already have liquid down here, I think. Um, let me see. Stations, utilities. No, uh, refinement, right? Refinement.
I'm blind. Oh, it's an oxygen thing. God damn it, man. Okay. Oh, God, they're not there yet. Hurry, go, go, go. Oh, shit. No. No. Deconstruct. Oh, okay. There's just no symbol on it. Not ideal, it's not the way I wanted to do it. Like, I have like a single layer right there, but I feel like it's a necessity. And we are gonna be eventually cool this area. And it's just gonna be easy to cool this in the base. I'm hoping that it helps and I could probably trim off this entire upper layer here and actually just allow the coolness from the bottom, the basement, to cool the top. But that's like a pipe dream, man. Like, to get this area with all these utilities cooler than the base itself, that means the base is either fucked or, uh, I don't know, I have some god tier cooling abilities or something, so. Come on, man, to get this last one, dude. Like, right now, somebody. <sighs> Got time for this nonsense. Build this shit right now, too. Uh, let's see, maybe like gold. Gold everything. Okay, pipes. Good, clean water, easy. What's that coming from? Doesn't matter. And then... Shit water... Oof, that's a trek. Could go down... I could go down and over, actually. Yeah. The depth of materials does not help. You're right. Totally right. There, I wish there was a way to, to have, like, a sensor on, um... The materials... Or what, what materials are made out of. You know? Like, or, uh, what temperature materials are. Clay, please fix. Please. Please fix. But yeah, I wish there was a way to see the temperature of something before you commit to, uh... You know, to, to, to... To using it. You know, like, if, if, if an item is over a certain temperature, like, just don't use that item. Use a different one. Let's see. That would be the dream. <laughs> All right, so this thing's gonna get to work, and it's gonna clear out all of this nasty. Oh, nice, convenient. Yeah, perfect. Good, and they're they're yeah, they're, they're gonna get up pretty quickly too. <sighs> then the Oxfords could just be a backup. All material temps when it's in the bit equalize. Oh. Hmm. Need a climate control storage pod to go cool stuff. Yeah, I wonder how long how long it takes to um something good. I wonder how long it takes to cool like a storage bin full of igneous rock at 120 degrees, right? Like how long does it take to cool that? If you put it in a room uh, or maybe put it in like an, an ice biome or something like that. Like, how long does it take to cool that? Like, that's... There's got to be a way to cool materials. The same way you can process materials to clean them of germs, there's got to be a way to, to process materials to cool them, right? Hmm. There we go. There we go. Chugga, 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 chugga. There we go. Yes! But it's, uh, it's going to get blocked, though, because it's not done over here, so it'll get blocked. But this problem is solved. The heat problem, though, that's not salt. It's gonna get hot. It's gonna get so hot. We made out of gold, though, so it's good. Melting point is what? Melting point is uh, 1900, but I have a feeling it's probably gonna start taking damage long before that. <laughs> it's 140 degrees right now. Once it, yeah, it's, it's chugging right now, but once it's done chugging, I think it'll be fine. Good, they're using the, uh, the conveyor loader. Awesome. Food, handle, what's wrong with this guy here? Body temperature. Dog, you're sitting right next to the thing. Oh, you're too cold. <laughs> what What a marvelous problem to have. It's, they're, they're too cold. Uh, yeah, wow, they're just straight up too cold. Should I disable the uh, <laughs> uproot this? I guess so. How funny, because we're pumping in gas at 89 degrees. I guess we could retire one of them. 
Use that somewhere else. Let's upload it and see. How funny. <laughs> uh, it's a transfer line that goes through a cool zone, then return to a bin. You mean like a conveyor? A conveyor would do it, right? Because those items still maintain their... Like, they still exist as an item on the... Yeah, look, it's, it's, it's an item. So it's on there. It's exposed. So that means... Ah, yeah, look. So they, they do maintain their... I guess their integrity of whatever they, they are. Um... Hmm. I see. I see. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> Holy crap. Our storage area is getting pretty packed. Yeah, I see. Alright, so this is working. Slowly but surely. I actually feel like we probably just kill these oxyferns too. Replace it. Because it's, it's, it's kind of blockading the area here. Right? Oh no. Not gonna let me do it. Let's go ahead and uh, deconstruct. Deconstruct. There we go. Oh crap, no, no. Uh, before you do that though, sweep this shit up. Sweep, sweep, sweep. Sweep it up. All of it. Water. They could get that. Let's go ahead and actually uh, deconstruct this and get this water out of there. Oh, there's some gold down there too. Oh yeah, from the item just fell, of course. Okay. Yay, nice and clean. I think that's better. So we should see this area get much cleaner. I hope. Which was the, the fan mod. I don't want to blow all those gases over. But our base is, is nice and, uh, I mean, in terms of, if we look at where we're at right now, right? Versus where we were when we started. <laughs> We were rough when we started. We had no gas ever, anywhere. We had no hydrogen. We had no uh, no oxygen. We basically had nothing. Um, and now, like now, we've done well with uh, yeah, with with keeping uh, the area oxygenated. We're, we've run into some gas issues here and there. Make an air circulation pump system to get this air in and out to to cool it or something. I mean, the air over there is chill actually. I should take the air from here and dump it down here, but. Yeah, time to HVAC. That's gonna be the next step. So, so here, here's like, here's like the the dream. Like I said, I want to get this area right here full of hydrogen, which is it's getting there. Like it's getting there. What is this? Dunnet framework updated to 4.0. Oh, okay, it's sorry. It was a uh, it was actually Oxnard included uh, update. Um, but yeah, I want to get this area just basically just full of hydrogen, and we're getting to the point now where we could we could pretty much almost seal this off. Not yet, but we're getting there. Um, yeah, if we could if we could take this area, seal it off. Actually, you know what we could do? Just to kind of even this out a little bit. Let's... No? 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 Obstructed by back wall. Oh, you have to... Oh, okay. I was gonna say, let's build uh, a flat line across here, and then we could use this for something else, like this little area down here, or just destroy all this stuff and um, insulate it or something. Anyways, uh, so... Yeah, so hydrogen, get this whole area filled with hydrogen. It's going to be there in, in just a number of cycles. Uh, this is going to start slowly. This is going to pretty much take care of itself eventually. All this stuff will move over. Uh, this is working. <laughs> this one little oxifern over here. They can sleep now with and be able to breathe, maybe? Kind of a mix of carbon dioxide and oxygen. Just a little mix there. Temperatures in the base are at... Well, on one side, they're great. <laughs> on the other side, it's a little warm. Um, God, those, those wheeze wards did such a good job. Like, I wonder if, I wonder if what I should do is seal this whole area off and make it so that there's one way in, like right here, one way in and a ladder that goes up and then they could work up here and whatever and just make it one, just basically it's one area, uh, that's, has nice cool air. We can swap out 
wheeze warts and move them around as needed. I could take that wheeze wart, I could move it somewhere else, like, like a gang of them, move them somewhere else, Turn, use them for like an HVAC system like I had in the old, uh, the old save. And there's a bunch of things we could do with it. But right now we're at a pretty decent place. We're definitely better than we were before. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. So it begins. <laughs> so it begins. That area is gonna go to shit. This water's still not pumped out. Still not pumped out. But look at all the oxygen we have over here. Oops. This is crazy. These oxyferns, the MVPs. Um, this is not all from the, uh, from, uh, opening up those pipes, those, uh, air ducts. This is from, like, a collaborative effort between, you know, these oxyferns, uh, which is, like, rich. Man, look at that. That's so much. Hmm. What's the temperature over here? Oh, that's really cool gas, actually. Probably loaded with slime lung, though. Not that I care. <laughs> oh, it's not, actually, huh? Maybe that's where we get our cool air from. We just stick a pump right here and just jack it into this. To let it just, you know, pump just oxygen only, of course. Huh, we'll have to come back and take a look at that, but that's that's an option. That's definitely an option. But that's a perfect stopping point. Cycle 600! 600, baby! Let's go and save this. New save. Space Bros Alpha 700 is our next goal. Perfect. Let's let's just continue looking around here just to make sure that we're good. This is crazy. Look at all the shit we've done. And you know, I, I've opened this up so much. We have so much room up here to uh, to expand as well. Um, I was thinking it probably end up being like another set of apartments or something like that. But let's look at the overlays. So yes. This side, I'm thinking we isolate it, right? I, I just kind of keep that area cool by itself. Um, then we could take those weeds warts and put them somewhere else. We could scatter them around the base if we wanted to. Then let them just basically cool the base um, naturally. It'll take a long time, as you can see over here. It takes a long-ass time. These things are still too hot. Just by 0 0.1 degrees. 0 0.1 degrees. Yeah, kind of funny. All right, but I think that's it, guys. I think we're good. I think we are good. 